Hello, and welcome to Real Estate in a Minute. I'm George Mueller with Century 21. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. As we dive into this week uh, before Thanksgiving, uh, just a couple things to keep in mind with the market. It is indicating a slight slowdown, but some, there's some fantastic opportunities for those looking to buy and sell. The last full week before Thanksgiving produced a 30% week-over-week bump in closed listings in MRED's marketplace, resulting in a fantastic number of 3,000 total closed listings. While the market is a 50% annual dip, 2021's weekly bump outpaced 2020's by 5%. Next, listings under contract saw a minor 4% dip from last week and outpaced last year by 9%. A good, good indicator here. People are still out buying. New listings here saw a 7% dip from last week while being outpaced by last year by about 11%. Take this with a grain of salt. We're heading into a holiday weekend. People are starting to slow things down a little bit. And also, we're into that end of the year slowdown slightly. But again, people are out looking is the bottom line. Rental numbers saw an 11% increase from last week while dipping 23% from last year. You know, I'll show some positives on this in the last slide, but there are some positives even though it's slightly below last year's numbers. As you can see here, open houses, they dip for the second straight week with a decline of 12% from last week. I do expect this to dip even further with the upcoming Thanksgiving weekend. But in December, I do expect this to go up uh, in, right around these numbers, maybe slightly higher. Uh, as you can see here, showings, people in the orange here, this is this year, people are out looking. Take uh, last year, 2020, as an outlier. Again, it's going to be higher than this year because people pushed their home searches back a little bit. But keep in mind, follow 2019's numbers. We're pretty much mirroring that as we go forward. Residential sold price, another indicator for uh, fantastic news for those looking to sell. The median price of $279,000 was $1,000 higher than this time last week and outpaced last year's by a nice 10% margin. Finally, as I said, the median rental price, a good indicator here, was $1,700 per month. And this was the same as last week and bested last year's numbers by $100 a month. Overall, though, a great market to buy and sell. Interest rates hovering right around 3%. You can get something 28, 29, depending on your credit, for a 30 year fixed, while medium home prices are outperforming last year's by about 10%. So, in summary here, with interest rates being low, home prices being high, your money does go fairly far. So, it is a good time to buy or sell. And if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. And that's real estate in a minute. Please feel free to reach out with any questions.